Hello everybody, Lagging Lean here with another video. Now for today's video, I'm going to be looking at how to make the characters from Twisted Bricks TLZA. In case you don't know what that is, Twisted Bricks is a YouTube channel that has made an amazing zombie apocalypse series. Make sure you guys go check out his channel, it's Twisted Bricks, I'll leave it down below. The guy's actually making a crazy movie. It's coming out, I don't know when, but it looks great. Now make sure you guys go check him out. And this is going to be how you can make the main three characters, Joe, Matt, and Gerald. This whole video was made with the full permission of Christian Stensley, the creator of Twisted Bricks. Now, special thanks to Brickvolt and Pino Toy Geek, I hope I got that right, for all of these cool pictures of the Lego figures I'm going to be showing. I really couldn't find many good photos on the internet, so special thanks to those guys. Okay, so Lego sets can be kind of expensive and hard to find at times. So I'd recommend you guys go check out FirestarToys.com. It's a very cool Lego site that has a wide selection of Legos. And pretty much all the pieces you need to make these characters are on that website. So I recommend you go check them out. Okay, but enough of me yapping. Let's get into the video. So the first character we're going to do is Gerald. Gerald actually has a very normal uh, standard appearance. It's kind of easy to make. The first thing you're going to need is the legs and the torso of a clone soldier from the Star Wars sets. Plenty of different Star Wars sets have this figure. You're going to need to change the arms to black instead of white and change the hands to yellow. Okay, now for Gerald's head. Gerald's two-sided head can be found in many different Space Police sets. Now, you can find Gerald's hair piece in a lot of different sets, but one of the characters that I do know has this hair is Agent Chase from the Lego Agent sets. And that's how you make Gerald. Okay, so the next character we're going to make is Matt. Now, Matt, like Gerald, has a very normal or kind of average appearance. and can be pretty easy to build. Now, the first thing you're going to need is the torso and the legs of one of the aliens from the Space Police sets. Now, you're going to need to change the red gloves to yellow hands. Now, Matt's headpiece is actually very common with older sets between 2005 to 2010, so you can probably get it off a lot of different sets, so that's why I'm not going to pick a specific Lego character. Now, for Matt's hair, you can get that off of some of the zombie characters in the Pirates of the Caribbean sets. And that's how you make Matt. Okay, guys, I think I saved the best one for last, Joe. Joe is honestly my favorite character, and I cannot wait to make him. Now, for Joe, a lot of his pieces come from Exo Force sets. Now, Joe's torso and pants come from Rio. He comes out on a lot of different Exo Force sets, and you're going to want to replace this arm with a yellow arm with a yellow hand. Again, this guy comes out in a lot of different Exo Force sets. Now, Joe's main head comes from Takeshi. From he also comes out in a couple of different Exo Force sets. Now, if you want to get Joe's extra heads, he has two alternate heads that he's used throughout the series. They also come from other Exo Force characters. Now, if you want to get Joe's mechanical arm, you can get it from the Alien Cyborg in Alien Conquest sets. You can also get it off of a couple of different villains from the Lego Agent series. Now, here's where I ran into a bit of a problem. You see, Joe's knife is not a real Lego. It does not come out on any Lego sets, and it's actually a custom-made piece. It's probably made by Brickforge or something like that. Okay, now for Joe's hairpiece, it comes from Obi-Wan Kenobi. You can get him in a couple of different Star Wars sets. And that is how you make all three of the main characters from Tristan Bricks TLZA. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did making it. It was really fun to make and find out what kind of pieces these characters came from. If you guys want me to, I can make a part 2 that has some other characters and how to make them. I think I know pretty much all the pieces that are needed to make these other characters and I would not mind making another one of these. So let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys go check out Twisted Bricks. It is incredible. It makes really good quality content. I will see you on the next video and as always, thank you guys for watching. Hold on a second. Will you guys turn that crap off?